Hello and welcome to a new video about digital technology. We are still talking about ADCs here. Today we are talking about the fastest, most advanced, maybe not, but most expensive, yeah, with the most effort, the so-called direct ADC. Direct ADC, they are really fast, almost instant digital value. How this is achieved, I show you with a lot of parts, actually. Yeah. So, the input looks the same. So we have somewhere, boop, input, puck. And in between we have our input voltage. We want to have a digital value. And then, then we start. We need a bunch of comparators. I only show eight now, yeah, but we need as many comparators as we have different steps. So actually what I show now, 8 would be 2 digit. No, 2, 4, 3 digit. 3 digit ADC. Uh, 3 bit, sorry, 3 bit ADC. So actually we have here comparators. How comparators are working, I've already explained. So we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 uh, comparators. Comparators have a plus and minus input. So they're comparing the voltage on those two, if the plus input is higher than the minus input, it will have a signal. Okay, so and I will connect this UI to all comparators to the minus input. This is how this looks like, all right. And here I have then input values. And here I also need already the correct step values I need for changing a bit. So here, for instance, I would have a comparison voltage of 0 0.5 volts. Here, for instance, 1.5 volt, here 2.5 volt, here 3.5 volt, here 4.5 volt, here 5.5 volt, here 6.5 volt, and here 7.5 volt. All right? So this comparator will put out one if the input voltage is above 0 0.5 volt. Huh? Then we will switch the first comparator. All others will stay zero. This comparator will then switch to one if the input voltage climbs above 1.5 volts. So then it, this is 1 and this is 1. All others are 0. And the more UI is rising, yeah, the more ones we will see. So we will start with 0 ones, then this is 1, then both are 1, then 3 are 1, then 4 are 1. So we will see a growing, a growing number of ones. Yeah. And this growing number of ones we will put into a memory. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. Every comparator will put its zero or one into this memory. And we will see then One, 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 a growing thing. This is called here unary code. Okay, this is unary code. Or also sometimes called thermometer code. 
wear the Thermometer coat because it looks like those ancient thermometers where this thermometer, the, the, the temperature was by expanding liquid, shown by expanding liquid in sort of a column, the length of a column. This looks exactly the same. Yeah? Well, and what's that? That's not the correct number, right? This is a growing counter of one. So what we need is we have then afterwards, here we have a coder. It will look into those ones and zeros and the output will be the digital value. And here we have binary. You know? A lot of effort. Imagine if you have a 12-bit ADC, then we would have 4,000 uh, 95 <laughs> comparators. Tremendous effort. But you see, instant, it's almost instant. I mean, it's just it's just the the the, 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 the edge times of those elements. Book instant result. Yeah? There's no counter needing to approximate. There is not tack fast. Yeah? This is if it really needs to be fast, direct ADC. Yeah? A lot of effort, very expensive. Fast, fast, fast. ADC. This is the last ADC I'm going to show you. Actually, it's not only the last ADC I'm going to show you. It's the last video of this series, of this digital technology series. We now know now a lot. Yeah? We know what is digital. Yeah? We know logic elements. We know how to simplify logic elements. We know time elements. We know counters, we know ADCs, we know the uh, DSCs, we know multiplexers, demultiplexers. Well, I would, I would call it a day, yeah, not only one day, yeah, I would call it a good bunch of work. Huh? Of course, there are always details. Huh? I just want to give sort of overview about those things that you understand how those things are basically working. If you want to dig in deeper, dig in deeper. For us, for me, that's it. There are other videos, other series of videos of mine. You can watch them if you like. You must not, but you can. For this time, thank you very much for listening. Goodbye.